Hey everybody, Micah Outdoor Living Guy here. I am excited today because I'm talking to you about how to waterproof a deck. It's something that people are asking all the time. Why not? If you have a deck, why not create a whole waterproof area so you can have a whole outdoor living space underneath it? We're gonna to talk to you all about it right now, educate you on the different methods, and show you lots of really good ideas right now. Enjoy. really don't downplay too much what you can do with the deck. They add an amazing covered space to your area. In fact, it's not just one space, it's two, because you have the whole upstairs area for a living space and you have the whole beautiful downstairs for a living space. So we're gonna shoot some B-roll of this, we're gonna let you see this project, but we're also gonna show some other projects that feature covered decks right now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump up to the top real fast and I'm gonna let you see it from the top and here we go. And here we go, now we're on the upper deck. What'd you think of that jump, by the way, pretty cool. So here we are, we're on the upper side. You can see the versatility that we have. Simple jump on up and all of a sudden you have a cool living space up here. And we're gonna bring you up here right now and show you how cool this upper area is. So we're gonna talk about some membranes and talk about how to waterproof a deck right now. So here we are at the upper deck and I just wanna let you see what a cool space this creates. So you have two spaces. So I wanna let you see the before of this covered deck. It's almost comical in fact, here we go. Now you can see there's hardly any room below. There's hardly any room above. And here what we have is just this beautiful space up here, beautiful space at the bottom. So this here, what we did here is a waterproof membrane. It's called a PVC membrane. This is a walkable, non-slip surface. So it's really something I would recommend. Now, there's other membranes that you can install that allow the deck or a deck material to be installed over it. So you basically have the benefits of a deck, but you don't see the membrane at all. And then there's some other water catching materials that we can show you that basically are installed either from above or through the joists of a deck. So don't underestimate the power of a deck, especially for creating a waterproof covered space below. They are very nice and for certain homes, it's really the only way I would recommend. So here we have the during of the deck project, the walkable PVC membrane. And here's the after. You can really see how dramatic the after is. And really the PVC membrane walkable is just fine. It looks nice. It does a great job with water. The one negative of course is it potentially could puncture and begin to leak long term, but it's not that hard to fix. But just look at what this gives us the ability to do underneath. This amazing outdoor room with a fireplace, an outdoor TV, amazing outdoor living, all lit up with the fan. It really provided dual outdoor living, both upstairs and this amazing outdoor space next to the swimming pool downstairs. So again, the walkable PVC membrane could be an amazing addition for the deck to give you that outdoor room. Now with this project, just look at what we had to start with here. They had extremely unusable space underneath their deck. But look at it now. Now with this deck, the homeowner did have a complete cover on the upper deck, but we wanted to ensure, and the homeowner wanted to ensure that the under deck area, which was completely unusable, would be okay. So the Trex rain escape was added and they turned their under deck area into a completely usable outdoor living space. They added a prep station, a bar, destination seating area, and then a whole outdoor kitchen for their outdoor under deck area. It also included a TV, which is a, a magnet, of course, for people, especially when 
they're out by the pool and they wanted to take a, just a, a chill time, have some food, have a drink. They can just go, go by the bar there. They're undercover, they're shaded, and just really added so much destination, so much outdoor living. But in the summertime, of course, that's gonna be party central for anybody in around the pool. So here we have a current deck project that's going on. This is a Trex Rain Escape under deck system. So I really wanna let you see the system, the way we install it. We're gonna show you some time lapse right here and let you see how it's done. So here we have the deck framing. So between each of the joists, we put in the Trex Rain Escape. Now this is basically a liner and it's a waterproof liner. And as you will see here, we staple it to the joist. We put in the seaming tape. Now this is extremely water tight, does an amazing job. And then it's hard to see, but at the very start, we put in the gutter system. And here we are, we just put in the, the deck boards over it, making sure that you do not puncture beyond that seaming tape. That's the critical part about putting in the Trex Rain Escape. So with this project, I want to let you see the before. I'm pointing here to a window that became a double door. And we are setting up and preparing for the deck. Now, here's the under deck area. It's amazing, just gravel. And then there's a pergola over it. But what we did is we just created a huge deck for the client. And then, of course, we did the under deck system. This was the tre Trex Rain Escape. And look at what we were able to accomplish by giving them a complete outdoor living space. Now the homeowner here decided to do some like a, a ninja warrior area for their kids to be able to play outside all time of year. But what the cool thing about this is they can turn this into an amazing outdoor living space in the future. Very easy. You just would take that synthetic lawn out, go ahead and add your outdoor living and all of a sudden you have this amazing outdoor living space. So as you can see, we did the tongue and groove. We completely prepared for the future with all the outdoor lighting. We brought in all of the electrical, all of the future gas needs. But right now, this is just a temporary area for their kids to hang out underneath. Of course, the adults will be on the upper side of that deck. So think about that. It's not just about now and the time that you're living in right now. You might have smaller kids and a really cool outdoor living space underneath a deck might be great for your life. But then in the future, as they get older, of course that outdoor living space will, will need to be updated. And you can always add the cool outdoor living that you've seen already in this video. Now with this deck system, the homeowner went with aluminum under deck system. It's definitely an option. This is more budget friendly. It does offer an attractive under deck area. It does have some problems. It does during heavy flows of water. It does not keep it completely dry, but it is a good option for a budget conscious under deck system. So here we have another Trex Rain Escape, but we did a drop ceiling on this project. It allowed room for the can lights, it allowed room for the fan, it allowed room for the heaters. But really the homeowner just wanted to step out dry, have a beautiful outdoor living space with their fireplace, the outdoor kitchen, the sink, and just a place to hang out all seasons. So the Trex Rain Escape or the under deck system does give you that ability to do that. If you need some help with a good design, I would love to help you with your deck and with your covered space and with your whole outdoor living space. So if you need it, let us know. We'd love to help you out with that. So guys, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and we will talk to you soon.